From Guatemala to the USA, he drinks his coffee every day. Blah 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 blah. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the garage in this coffee roaster build. Today, I am making a new agitator for my coffee roaster. I really wanted to turn, turn. I wanted the direction to go a different way. I did. One of the things about using a drill motor, cordless drill motor, I have an angle one of these, with the length of the drive shaft, it's real difficult to tighten up uh, the, the chuck. With the, with the facing the roaster, the direction was clockwise, and I wanted it, I needed it to go counterclockwise. It just works out well with the cordless chuck. So I purchased another one of these polar wear steam table domoplaches and fabbed it up, cut it with my handy dandy just straight shears. It does pretty well with the stainless. Um, so let me uh, show you what I'm doing over here and get it fitted up and see how everything lines up. So let's take a look at the inner drum and this new auger. What I have, I don't know if I've actually shown this off. I should go back and look at the videos, but <laughs> oh well. So anyway, uh, in my inner vessel, I have a air hole here, I think about an inch and a half with a pizza screen covering up uh, I sort of have it half bolted down help keep the beans in and the trick to this is keep your drum speed down excuse me your uh, auger speed down and beans won't get up this high to be pushed out what I have on bottom is a little I think that would be referred to as a thrust washer it's homemade I have a cookie sheet and keeps it off of the back of the drum here I have my bean mass temp type K and I'm just checking my alignment everywhere and I'm a little tight here on bottom but I'll fix that I'll just bend up that little lip right there and this is what I've got now this new um, new drive shaft is just 3H tube uh, 304 stainless with all stainless steel hardware here and these are just a, a flat piece of uh, uh, u-bolts i got this these screws and and flat washer and nuts bolts all from mcmaster car it's a great place to pick up uh some good hardware but that's what it looks like 